Derry, 3-1 defeat in the North London derby against Arsenal. What did you make of that very, very negative performance? Yeah, obviously. Um, I'm so embarrassed. I really am. Um, when I went into the dressing room after the game, I was so angry. Uh, they were showing the highlights of the game on the TV, and I got so angry that I kicked the TV, and uh, Richarlison fell over. You know, that, that, that's, you know that, that's normal for him, I know, but... Last week, I played for a manager who likes to put 25 men behind the ball and, uh, and then I come back here to Hottenham Totspur and uh, play for a manager who likes to put 55 men behind the ball. You know, we were deeper than the specific ocean, we really were. Frig my life, yeah, obviously. Conte looked furious. What did he have to say in the dressing room to the players? Yeah, obviously, uh, he was really angry. Uh, he was screaming swear words in his language, uh, but uh, none of the lads could understand because uh, we don't speak a word of German. Um, he was pulling his hair transplant out on the touchline all game, yeah, obviously. Just 2% possession, Harry. Do you think Conte is far too negative? Yeah, listen, it's OK. Uh, you're playing that way against Empoli in a mid-table Italian league clash. But, you know, this is the Premier League and um, you, you just can't do that, uh, to be fair. I don't want to spend 18 minutes of the game in my own six-yard box. And the only time we attacked was uh, in the game was when Emerson Royale horrifically attacked Martinelli with a two-foot challenge in his chest. Yeah, obviously. And just how is the team morale after this very, very poor, poor performance, Harry? Yeah, obviously, uh, it's not good. Um, look, it's that bad. Now, Richarlison, you know, had his head in his hands and he was crying after the game saying he really wants to go back to Everton. To Everton. That's how bad it is, yeah, obviously. Can Conte turn this around and make Spurs the best team in the Premier League? Yeah, obviously, best team in the Premier League. Uh, well, not even the best team in North London. You know, we are behind Arsenal and Chelsea and West Ham and QPR and Fulham and Barnet. Yeah, obviously.